Hey guys, in this video, we're going to be talking about building a personal brand, how you can attract high paying tech jobs, eliminate the competition and never have to submit a single job application if you implement the strategies that we talk about in this video. So buckle up and get ready to jump into tech. Let's go. Hey Cyber Heroes, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Boyd Clewis, six-figure tech career coach and internationally recognized cybersecurity expert, and I help people upgrade their jobs to a six-figure tech career. If you wanna join me on this journey, be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the red bell so that you're notified whenever I drop new content weekly, guaranteed to take your career to six figures and beyond. Okay guys, I'm super excited to share this with you because when it comes to personal branding, like I learned this stuff the hard way and it cost me. So hopefully you can just sit back with your snuggie on, some popcorn in a can and listen to this sauce and avoid the heartache that I have. So if you don't know who I am, I'm Boyd Clueless and I went from 33K on the help desk to making over 200,000 a year as a security consultant and becoming a multimillionaire after starting my own cybersecurity consulting firm. So the thing that I'm giving you, they worked and they have produced some amazing results for me as well as my clients around the world. So let me take you back to about 2009. 2009, I'm making like around $33,000 working at the copier company, doing my break fix work. And on my LinkedIn profile, I am talking about all the sweet initiatives that the company had going on, which was Rico, how they were changing the industry. They were shaking up the industry, all this cool stuff. And so what happened is the company's executives actually flew in and they fired us all, literally. They shut down operations in Dallas and moved it to Orange County, California. So now it is 70 of us without jobs. And so I got this LinkedIn profile, all this content talking about this company that I have no association with anymore. And that's when it hit me. That makes zero sense because I can't do anything with that information anymore. And so I realized from that day forward, I was going to manage my career like a business and I was never going to be an employee again. Yes, I had jobs after that one, but I didn't look at my employer as my boss. They were a client because I was a business and I am a service provider. So I made the switch. Instead of marketing and branding and talking about what the company was doing, I talked about how I was bringing value to the company company that I was working at. So I'll talk about tech initiatives that I was working on, conferences that I was going to, my thoughts on things that were happening inside of the industry. And so what began to happen is I began to accumulate a following on LinkedIn and people started taking interest in the things that I was posting. So it's important that you hear me when I'm telling you this. Personal branding is about what you want people to think about you when they see your face, when they hear your name. What is that image that you want? In my LinkedIn profile, I have about 21,000 followers, right? And what do I talk about? Business, leadership, cybersecurity, information technology, career things, right? And so what I want people to associate with my brand is the grit, the hustle, the drive, the out of the box, things to order to achieve something great. Cause like guys, I didn't graduate from college to accomplish the things that I've accomplished. All I have is a high school diploma. And so the other thing is that my brand is very congruent with what I talk about. What do I do? I help people upgrade their jobs into high paying tech careers. How do I do that without certifications or college degrees or anything like that? And I make content around that, which brings me to the next thing. It's important that you leverage social media like LinkedIn and Twitter to actually create content around your area of expertise to showcase your knowledge, your talent, because it doesn't matter how good you are if nobody knows. You cannot be the best, the world's best kept secret and expect to get ahead. And so the challenge is most people put all their eggs and beliefs in the thought that a college degree or a certification is going to get them the job when you can literally 
Write your own check and curate opportunities just by building a personal brand and showcasing your personality and your thoughts. Because the same people that are gonna interview and hire you are going to be the same ones that are on LinkedIn, the same ones that are on Twitter. You can literally leverage this technology to create a whole new way for your career, but you have to get out of the box. You gotta stand out from the crowd and actually do the work. And when I started doing this, what I noticed was people would reach out to me via my inbox on LinkedIn and they would send me job opportunities that I could interview for. So if you think about this, I am completely bypassing the job application, sitting online, searching for opportunity to opportunity. I was creating them just by sharing my thoughts on what, the, what was going on in the industry, specifically to the niche that I was working in, which is PCI. And here's a great example right here. So this article right here is something that I wrote back in 2017, guys. I wrote this article about wireless being in scope for PCI compliance or not. And I got a lot of good feedback in my inbox about this specific piece that I wrote that only took me a few minutes. And one of the things that you have to think about now is with this day and age of using AI, chat GPT things out there, you don't even have to be the type of person that knows how to write well. You can give prompts to the AI and they will create some very good thought provoking posts, right? Just wanna make sure that you can actually live up to what the bot is writing about, right? Sharing your thought processes, not somebody else's, because at the end of the day, it's gonna be you that's doing the work. When I talk about displaying your thought leadership it doesn't have to be anything spectacular as a matter of fact let me show you an example okay so back over here on my linkedin profile this is something that i posted a year ago now understand what i'm doing is i am hijacking some authority here robin hood had a data breach bloomberg actually wrote about it so i'm using a credible source i take the link and all i do is just make a comment about it use the right hashtags for the audience and make a post about it. And this thing reaches over 20,000 people, 21 reposts, which gives me instant credibility, guys. Like this is the stuff that I'm talking about. It is super simple. It doesn't have to be complex. Just find things that are happening that are trending in the industry, which there's tons of it. You just gotta know where to look. You can sign up for um, RSS feeds or your popular, man, Google News has a lot of good stuff that will tell you about security incidents and things that are going on. But you wanna do is consistently, at least once a week, post something on LinkedIn to display your thought leadership create content around your ideas, how you see the world, showcase your personality, your skill set. And I'm talking about a minimum of once a week. Step it up to three, four times a week if you want to. And when you get started, you may not see a lot of traction, but it will build. Don't get discouraged if people are not liking or sharing your stuff. Continue to do it. We all have to start somewhere. We all have to start somewhere, but get out there and do it. And you would be like, amazed at the response and opportunities that you'll curate. All right, cyber heroes, so let me know in the comments, did you know that you could attract high paying tech roles just by building your own brand on social media? Let me know, I wanna hear from you. Because if you're looking for a way to learn in-demand skills and how to market and brand yourself as a cybersecurity specialist, then I invite you to apply to the Baxter Clues Training Academy. You can go to www.boydclues.com forward slash GRC to check out our case study to see how we've helped more than 400 people upgrade their jobs to six-figure tech careers and how you could do the same. All you have to do is apply. Now understand space is limited. So go over to the website or click the link in the description to see if Baxter Close Training Academy is the right fit for you. If you got value from this video, be sure to like it, subscribe to the channel, and hit that red bell so that you notify whenever I drop new content, guaranteed to take your career to six figures and beyond. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.